Hi guys, welcome back to another video. My name is Bhumika and in today's video we are seeing class 7 chapter number 8. Chapter's name is Mo Equal. So in this video, uh, in the previous videos, we have completed with the translation and with this uh, vocabulary words. In today's video, we are seeing the grammar topic of this uh, chapter that is the prepositions. So what are prepositions? Firstly, we should know. So as the word suggests us, what are prepositions? So prepositions. So something that defines the position of an object are called as prepositions. Okay. So something that defines the defines the position of the object. Okay. Something that defines the position of the object. Something. Or we say the words which define the position of an object. Okay. So there are a lot of words here. We'll be seeing each one one by one. So sure, on, su, under. Afo, before, apre, after. For, for, contra, against. Do, in, dehor, outside. Afek, with, so, without. Devo, in front of, derriere, behind. Entre, between, lua the, far, pre the, near, a gauche de is to the left, or a the is at the right, a cote the is beside, okay, o de su the is above, o de su the is below, o face is facing, o bua the that is at the end of, a quan the that is at the corner of, a milia the is in the middle of, o for the is at the bottom, okay. So here we see the bunny is inside, right? So do means what? Do is in. Sur is on. So we can see the uh, this is on, right? On this box. A cote the is near, right? Or you say it as beside. Fine. So this is derriere is what? Behind. Right? Derriere is what? Behind. Next is Druat. So Druat means what? To the right. So this is here is the box and it is to the right. Su is under. So it is under the box. And Agoshe is to the left. Fine. So even this should be learned by you all. Fine. So yeah, that is all. We'll be seeing the exercises in the further videos. Thanks for watching everyone.